Asalaamu As Alaikum and hello everyone, Punjabi cyclist here. I've been looking at ways to get nice aerial shots of me cycling and for you, for you as viewers as well. I've been looking at three options. One is hire a helicopter and get them to take some lovely shots. But obviously, medical press at the end. So I'm not GCN or Eurosport, so forget that. The next one was drone shots, but then drone will be headache here. If I start flying a drone first, I have to check the regulations. Can I fly? Is it gonna go in the trees? I won't pay attention on the road. So then I'm gonna hit a pothole, then fit another crash, and then I can't, my body can't take any more crashes at this age. So then last option I had was the Insta360 extended selfie stick. So out of the three options, the only viable one is this one here, because I can pull it out my jersey and then shoot and then I don't have to worry about anything else. Of course, the Insta360 Extended doesn't replace a drone. It's no substitute for a drone, but at the end of the day, it's the most viable option I have while I'm cycling. Now we're gonna have a look inside. I had a Dubai yesterday, I and it. It's a lot of Dubai, actually. It's kind of a big box here. Okay, I don't wanna rip it apart because if it's broken, then you will have to go back again, innit? All the way back to China. Hopefully, it's not. It's so lovely. This is the massive extended selfie stick. So you don't have to go to three meters all the way. You can always go to one meter, uh, two meters or three meters. You don't have to extend it, extend it all the way up. And when you compare this one to my current one, which is this one here, they call Bacha Davadiyama. Look at that. Get over the difference here. Look at this. Look at this massive one here. So this can go up to 120 centimeters. This one goes to three meters. So. I'm expecting this one to go way up there and give me some lovely shots. The way I'm gonna use this selfie stick compared to my other one is mainly when I take a coffee break is I can stand there and extend it fully to three meters. It will be more stable. Whereas the other one is more lighter and I can attach it to my, to my mount at the front of the bike. This one I'll try to mount it, but the risk is it, it could, could fall off because it's quite heavy compared to the other one, especially when you attach the camera to it as well. I'm gonna go on a ride now and test this out and let you guys know how it goes. Testing out the extended selfie sticks in a number of positions. This is what I think is best. I mean, as you can see at the front, the selfie, extended selfie stick is made of carbon fiber, which is good, it's solid. But the issue is it's very heavy. It's noticeably heavy than the than the one meter one. And at the front of the bike, as you can see, I haven't even extended it. Not even one meter, I'll say. Maybe this is just about one meter, I'll say. I mean, roughly. I've cycled it with that. I'm more comfortable with that. If I stretch this any further, the chances of the camera falling is very high. I mean, the camera will fall. I mean, this, because the problem is this thing is so heavy. It's, even though I've tightened, this is, a, this is a motorcycle mount, it's not even a bicycle mount. This thing is so heavy that it's pulling, the, the weight of it, even I've tightened it, the weight of it is so, it's just pushing it down, it's pushing it down. So as you can imagine, if I pull this all the way out, which I'm gonna do here, and I'll, just to demonstrate, there we go, there's the camera. Yeah, camera hitting the floor. There's no way you can cycle like that. It's just not gonna happen. So that's uh, for the front. That's how far I would say, if you're gonna buy this, this is how far you should go, in my opinion. I mean, to be honest, what I'm gonna do, I'll use my one meter selfie stick, which is not this carbon fiber heavy duty one. I'll use the one meter selfie stick for when I'm shooting from the front, because that way I know it hasn't got much weight and it will hold and I can go a bit further down. And this one I will mainly use is for, to hold it onto the uh, handlebar when I'm cycling. So what I mean is when I'm, when I'm in on the handlebar, so on, when I'm on my right, I'm holding the, handlebar with one one hand but the only how high i'm gonna go so it's not meant, it's not gonna be three meters it's not gonna be two and a half i think it's roughly just under two meters once it gets to three meters it starts to get very wobbly with the small carbon fiber bits because these just get smaller and smaller when you keep pushing it out they get smaller as you can see they get smaller so the smaller they get, the weaker they get, the weaker they get, the camera's gonna fall and it's party over time. As I mentioned, that if you have a cafe stop or I'm stopping here, because you, you're fully stable, you can push it all the way up because obviously you're not on the bike. So you're not riding with it. Everything is fine. So all you're doing, you're holding it like this all the way up because this one definitely gives you the best aerial view you can get 
by extending it to three meters and then leaving your bike to the side and then holding it and pushing it all the way up to three meters. All right, after testing out this massive heavy duty extended three meter selfie stick with a number of ways after testing it out, okay, where shall I mount it? As I already mentioned, okay, mounting it in front of the bike, I wouldn't do. Using it while cycling can be done, but again, if you wanna be extra cautious, and the best way to use it and the way I'm gonna use it and the reason why I bought it was to show the nice lovely countryside or the area I am cycling in. The other th place I thought I could use it was with my this belt um, insta call it back bar belt or back ball belt whatever you want to call it but it's a heavy duty belt I mean I call it a boxing belt it's like a heavyweight championship belt is bloody heavy. I mean, just to carry this, I have to get my backpack with me. I mean, if I was to wear this, there's no way I'll be able to cycle. I mean, it's just gonna squeeze my tear to the max and that's it. Jo me khadda osa agud baar nikal ana and then fir ulti ani and vomiting all the way. So it's not gonna work. So I just tested it, tried to stretch it up. I tried it, but the issue is because it's so heavy, it doesn't stay in the middle of the ride it doesn't stay in the middle it just sways to the left sways to the left oh, i don't know how many times i have to, I have to stop it two three times i mean i'm gonna use it for my hiking i like hiking long walks so that's perfect for that as well so a quick summary would i mount it on my bike no would i hold it when i'm riding maybe but i wouldn't push it all the way to three meters wouldn't do that i would maximum go to two meters what do you think would you buy an extended three meter selfie stick? Are you happy with one meter? GoPro is still good. I love GoPro. The audio is awesome. The audio is terrible on the, on the Insta cameras, I have to say. Anyway, thank you everyone for watching. I shall see you next.